So I'm Roadhawk, or Roadhawk Wilson, as you might know. And this channel has grown. So today I would like to tell a story. Today I heard a song. It, it started off with, I'm on vacation every day, every day, because I love what I do. And I do. I, I love what I do. I have eight jobs. And I do each of them with a passion and a vigor that very few people do their regular job with. Because they are not as happy in what they do. But I'm also an advocate. And getting in front of a camera, doing this, this is easy. This is super easy. In fact, I work with Right Care Alliance. I've worked with Poetry for Person Power. Shout out to both those organizations. I've worked with so many organizations I can't remember. In fact, I the list goes would be too long for this video. And I'm only 27. But what I really want to say is is if someone's knocking on your door, if someone's talking to you, if someone brings up healthcare. I know it's a hot button issue right now. But a lot of people are about to be uprooted by Medicare because they're changing their system. They're they're doing a lot of changes. And those of us who advocate We've, we've seen the system fail. It's not perfect. And we, we believe that things can be better. We want them to be better. But we have a passion. We have a drive. And we don't want to see anyone else get hurt. And yes, healthcare could be the equivalent of the boxing arena of life. It, 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 Almost no one can have a conversation on healthcare without feeling like they're miserable nowadays. But it's not our job to hurt. It's not our job to make people miserable. And yet sometimes it happens. Because never should you actually go out and punch a person. That's just bad form. See what I did there? Anyways. One percent of the human population will actually make that correlation just because I'm so rambly. I I advocated today for Medicare and how the system is broken, how this transition they're doing is broken, and yet I walked away feeling like I got punched in the face by Mike Tyson, Muhammad Ali, and I, I'm gonna say Lou Ferrigno for variety because. I had to point out what was wrong with someone's system. I had to say, hey, you know, this this should be better because a lot of people with mental illness don't make the best decisions. And if you do, you do. But the reality of it is, and I can speak from experience, there are moments where we don't. If, if our brain is hardwired a certain way, it's hardwired a certain way. We can't hold ourselves to the conformity of everyone because we're not everyone. And it doesn't make it right or wrong. But this was over the phone. And the person I was talking to was a lovely lady. Brilliant, congenial, talked to me about Thanksgiving, and then I had to have this conversation. And I was nice. I was trying to affirm that she was a wonderful person, but I well I, I walked away with that feeling, and I do that on a constant basis. And the point of this discussion is to say, if someone's knocking on your door, if if someone's trying to advocate to you, it's not that we're trying to punch you in the face. It's that we are trying to get across that there's a very broken system out there. And unfortunately, so many people in the world are affected by this broken system. And we don't want that to happen to anyone. We, we want to be gentle. We want to be kind. But we are warriors. We are healthcare warriors. And we will fight for those we care about. We will do that. But we will do it with words. We will do it with wisdom. 
because, you know, if I were to punch a guy, I'd put him in a hospital, or he'd laugh, either one, because it would tickle. But that would defeat the purpose, would it not? Because one of us would get hurt. But never in my life would I do that, in all seriousness, in all joking aside. Because the people I set out to save, the people I want to save, people I want to help, they need gentility. And every day, every day I love what I do, and every day, every day I'm on vacation. Because I love what I do. So hopefully I got across a message that I love what I do, but I do it with a passion. And I do it with a mission to tell you that I will fight for those I care about. Because I am a healthcare warrior. With that, I'm Roadhawk Wilson saying, I will see you later. Stay healthy. Keep healthy. And help others be healthy. And I will see you later.